certified honorary BCC member, Mr. Channing. Where the hell is he? Let's see if make a grand entrance. So. 
Alright, alright, alright. So, by not show of hands, who's seen me on Comedy Central, BET, Comics Unleashed? Is she white? I don't even look over there. Is she? I don't want to look over there. Look, she fucking shit up already. These motherfuckers been killing the white race before I got up here. And then she want me, put me in, coach. Put me in. What's up, Dodie? Oh, my God. DJ Dodie, yeah, that's right. We keep it real with the white motherfucker. Look, he on the white DJ in this motherfucker. Don't be showing hands like I DJ too. <laughs> Give this motherfucker a chance, shit. Back to joke number two. <laughs> shit. No, I've, I've honestly been on, uh, who, who has seen me by, by a show of hands? Who has seen me on BET, Comedy Central, Comics Unleashed? This shit's confusing. <laughs> All right. <laughs> No, if you would have caught joke number one or two, I believe it was by a not show of hands. So either or, man, I'm just trying to look good. All right, joke number three. I got fucking roommates, man. I tell you what, roommates get a pain in my ass. Who here got some roommates? By a show of hands, who got roommates? I tell you what, man. My roommates got it down pat, though, man. If I leave some shit in the washer... My roommate, they're, they're pretty good at knowing, like, what gets dry and shit, because, you know, us black folks, shit, we got shit that you don't dry, right? We got shit that you do not motherfucking dry at all. Shit, leave that motherfucker in the washer, and if I don't get to that motherfucker shit the day after, leave it in the washer, I'll hang dry that motherfucker and wash it again. We do not touch the dryer or some shit. What's the dryer? This was fucked up, though. See, what it is, is I left some shit in the washer, and my roommate done fucked up, put it in the dryer. you damn right. You might as well bury my ass face first in the sand and spit on my ass. I was hot than a motherfucker. So I wrote a note. I said, to whom it may concern <laughs> You do not dry this. <laughs> Academic, Nietzsche. Hey, I tell you what though, Nietzsche's been falling off. Anyways, <clears throat> you do not dry this, please. Por favor, whatever language is in, please in Spanish, Russian, I don't give a fuck. Please do not dry this. So the next day, shit, I'm getting my shit out the laundry and shit, you know, the dryer and washer. And I see a note that's taped to the dryer. I'm like, oh, hell no. This I'm about to move out this motherfucker. They want to write me back? <laughs> Shit. So I got a little motherfucking note off the fucking dryer, pissing the motherfucker. I'm like, you're going to read it anyways. Even if you, you can be mad that a motherfucker got somebody, they write you a letter, you're going to read it. You may tell a motherfucker, like, I ain't even read that shit. I just <laughs> see it. But you damn right, we read that motherfucker. That's for real. So I got to reading this motherfucking letter, and it said, Dear Channing Wasson, no warrants. I can say the last name. I don't give a fuck. It said, Dear Channing Wasson, if you want your laundry done, do it your damn self or move out. Love, Mom. <laughs> you guys laughing at shit. I was still pissed. I was still pissed off about this shit. Because you know damn good well I wouldn't be there if I could move out. <laughs> shit. So I wrote a letter back pissed and shit. <laughs> But this time, I ain't put my madness in the letter. It's a mama love you. Thanks for trying. I'm still there, motherfuckers. I ain't living in a car yet. I don't even know where I'm at, to be honest. Joke number four. Give this motherfucker a beer or a shot. That motherfucker has got the numbers down packed and everything. Sober in the month. Shit. 
too scared to look up here and shit. I fuck with the flavors, baby. You look familiar as fuck, though. Do we know each other? Probably just friends on Facebook, dude. I'm dropping shit. You don't get a white motherfucker in a bar that serves beer. I'm surprised I don't got one with me. I do. I'm gonna take a drink for a second. No, for real though. I'm gonna be honest. I do got something to say. I just, I just don't know how to say it right now. I don't know how to say this. I ain't gonna say it anyways. I brought a condom tonight too, just in case shit gets intense. I bought a Magnum, but it says Trojan on it. I don't know what the fuck they fucked up and shit. I don't know where they fucked up at. No, I was at work, man. This, is, this I, I need a guy's honest opinion, man. Is this gay or is this not gay? Because uh, I'm on the fence with this shit. So I'm at, I'm at work and shit. Okay, motherfuckers get pop-ups, man. We dudes, man. Anybody still get pop-ups? I get the motherfucker. I'm horny like a motherfucker every fucking day of the week. Pop-ups pop is when you get a motherfucking boner and just... Oh, shit, what is this? What the fuck is this? I'm at work. There ain't no females at my job. What the fuck is this? But this motherfucker got to, like, talking and shit, and he looked back, man, his hand went like that. And when his hand went like that, it, like, touched it. <laughs> now listen, man, this ain't, I need to know if this is gay or not. When he touched it, I kind of almost had a pop-up shit before he touched it, because it was, you, you, you can't control them, motherfuckers. They just, they show up. But is it gay that I felt confident? Is it gay that I felt confident? Like, okay, this motherfucker touched it, but shit, I ain't small right now, though, fuck. Shit, I ain't little right now. That's gay? Damn, motherfucker, man, I need some pussy that I need it fast. Bye. Bye. Somebody get this motherfucker, Mike. Obviously, he's the funny guy. This the littlest motherfucker in here, too. Stand about four foot three. With attitude, he's like four foot three and like a couple inches, maybe. Like four foot five. He's going four foot five, though, right now. But I gotta keep it short and shit, man, because there's no other motherfuckers behind me. But you know what? I'm gonna drag it out. <laughs> Fuck, I've been paid. Shit. You're damn right. I ain't had some motherfucking food stamp shit this month. What's up? Shit, five, five, five to get you ten of groceries, brother. I don't play. You know, hey, I'm just being honest. I'm just being honest. You come with like some 455 and some fucking pennies, I'm gonna say, hey, bro, this other dude behind me said he'd give me 60 for 30. I'm gonna go to him. No, man, everybody wants to say cracker and shit. We can't say the M bomb. I did a show at Snickers, and they were like, before you get on stage, we want you to know something. No F bomb and no N bomb. They ain't tell me shit when I got on this motherfucker. So I can say naggers. I hate naggers. <laughs> shit. Motherfuckers just nag, 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 nag. <laughs> Fuck them. Worthless motherfucking naggers. That's all they are. Just fucking nag, nag, nag. But this, no, no, no. People get offended. White folks get a bit offended on the fucking cracker shit. Who gets offended on cracker shit? You need fucking crackers. My man said right there, soup. You gonna need some motherfucking crackers. You give you some motherfucking chili. You gonna need some goddamn crackers. You get pulled over in your motherfucking Cadillac with rims, they find a roach in the motherfucking ashtray. You gonna need at least two crackers to get your ass out of trouble. Thank you, folks. That's my motherfucking time.